United States Navy at sea, guarding America's interests and trade, protecting America's safety and freedom, and you are a part of it. The U.S. Navy is experimenting with a brand new combatant, a sleek high-speed vessel, HSV. HSV X2 will be used to test various scenarios. As an example, today your orders are to penetrate, reconnoiter, and secure a denied coastal area, conduct anti-submarine and mine warfare, and get ready to deploy special operations forces. These littoral seas, often poorly charted, confront you with unique challenges. Islands, reefs, and fjords, shallow depths, and a complex acoustics environment. This is a place of many dangers. Your enemy may employ inexpensive, asymmetric weapon systems that include mines, tactical and anti-ship missiles, and quiet diesel-electric submarines lying in ambush. You don't know yet if these threats really exist, but you've seen intelligence reports indicating a potential for danger, and you don't want to go in blind. You need to know what's out there before you take your ship and your crew into harm's way. HSV X2 can easily deploy the Sea Talon concept, developed by Lockheed Martin's Naval Electronics and Surveillance Systems under Sea Systems. Lockheed Martin would use small, cost effective, unmanned underwater vehicles that can be deployed from surface ships and submarines standing safely offshore. Stealthy, unseen, and unsuspected, these UUVs can reconnoiter the littoral battle space and send vital data to ship and fleet commanders. These unmanned vehicles can deploy and leave behind sensor arrays for extended surveillance. The HSV X2 can now launch two remote multi mission vehicles, similar to the U.S. Navy's ANWLD 1 remote mine hunting vehicle, to take over where the smaller UUVs left off. They can cruise the search area for many hours, even days, at top speeds. Deploying highly sophisticated sonar, they virtually X-ray the littoral battle space. Using advanced, proven algorithms, these sonars can be real-time, environmentally adapted to chart physical and acoustic characteristics of unknown, uncharted, underwater environments. On station. These stealthy semi-submersibles can deploy sensors below thermal layers in the water column and using a side-scan sonar, detect tethered mines and seafloor-based mines or using a towed lightweight broadband variable depth sonar, LBVDS, detect lurking enemy submarines. Sonar echoes from these threats are received by the seafloor-based sensor array and also by towed arrays deployed from other UUVs or surface ships. From there, the signals are relayed via unmanned aerial vehicles, surface ships, other aircraft, and even satellites. They enter a sophisticated communications network that connects ship and fleet commanders and command and control centers in real time. As sensor signals flow through the network, data is refined into information Information becomes knowledge as ship and fleet commanders are presented with a common underwater picture, detailed, comprehensive, and updated in real time. The Sea Talon concept enables them to greatly reduce enemy threats, navigate safely in uncharted waters, and deploy their forces with maximum effectiveness. It also allows them to make timely command decisions and fight and win in the literals. Sea Talon a truly transformational concept and vision. Leveraging existing U.S. Navy investments in commercial off-the-shelf technology integrated into proven, unmanned, inexpensive underwater and aerial vehicles with sophisticated software and networking, the concept can easily become reality in very short order. All its components are now under development and most are in the final testing stages. Sea Talon enables our naval forces to operate more effectively and safely in the littorals and in hostile regions where there is no forward basing. Lockheed Martin Sea Talon provides the United States Navy with the best possible underwater detection capability for the foreseeable future. We never forget who we're working for.